All right, today I wanted to do some squats, but I got a squat Friday for uh, Wendler, and I'm going to bench press Friday. So I said, you know what, I'm going to do some overhead squats, because I'm not going to squat as much, and it'll just help me with my form and my comp confidence in the positions that you have to go through when squatting. So I got about 155 on here, and I'm up and down, feels okay. Going up to body weight here, and my experience is when you get to body weight with, you know, like overhead squats or any Olympic lifts, it's always just a kind of kind of a different feel because you're kind of underneath more weight than you are. And here I am, 170 pounds. The other thing here is you got to start really push pressing the weight up, and I haven't done push presses in a while, so... You know, 170 out of the snatch grip takes a little extra energy, so I get it up there and down. I come up strong. I feel so good. Forget about these Chinese girls. I'm coming after Natalia Sabalatnaya, 75 kilogram women's champion with 131 kilogram snatch. Yeah, she's got bigger quads than me. She's got more hair. But let me tell you this in Russia, do they have like general nutrition centers at every strip mall where you can get the latest whey protein isolates and branch chain amino acids? I think not. And what about the creatine? Wait, creatine's illegal. You can't do that. So I'm going for 175 here and forget about it. Man, I buckled under. I buckled, buckled under like I was in Sissyville. And so I thought this would pay off with the hang snatches. So I went and did a couple of hang snatches, but I, I felt pretty shot here. This is a mush. This is 115 pounds, and uh, I'm not getting under them. I thought that, I thought those overhead squats would just like get me ass to grass in the snatch position. I finish off with 135. Let's call it a day. Let's go. Uh, I'm gonna take a walk tomorrow. Give my body a little rest.